to Five Oaks Rachel Carson Middle School. My name is Brian Foran, and I will be your drama teacher, as I'm a theater arts teacher in the district. Today, in this video is to introduce myself to you. So Mr. Foran will be your teacher, and I want to make sure you kind of see who I am, so that when we're meeting on the 14th in September, you'll be, oh yeah, I'm in the right place. And I want to help you with that. So, welcome. And I also wanted to give you some understanding of what's going on. Just some general information about the current state of things. So we are not meeting in person. We're doing remote learning this fall from September 14th through November 13th. And on the 13th, we as a district will decide if we're able to go back to regular school. And uh, fingers crossed, because that's, that's much more fun for everybody, I think. But I'm, I'm having fun with the technical side, and I hope you are too. Okay, other things to know. We're meeting Monday, Tuesday, not Wednesday, Thursday and Friday. On Wednesday, we teachers meet and do grading and collaboration, and we also try to do contact with you, the students. So this is a, an important day for us. Wednesdays are going to be a busy day for us. All right. Uh, so yeah, expect phone calls and emails if you're not showing up to class. Unlike the spring, attendance does matter. Unlike the spring, we are grading, so you will pass or not pass a class based on the output, your work that you do. But don't worry about that. We'll explain that when we get into class. The so most important thing for you to know is how to get into class. So you can go onto Canvas, and there is a Zoom link you can push. Now, if you don't know what Canvas is, I will have a link for you underneath my video that I send out. All right. And that's critical. Check that out before you get to class. Canvas, it's where we go for schoolwork. It's where we go to look for work. It's where we go to turn work in. Canvas. All right, moving right along. So what I'm trying to do is enrich your lives with that knowledge. And then you take that knowledge and you live your life with it. And you become a wonderful human being with that basic knowledge that we're in story. But that knowledge doesn't come cheap. You have to understand it takes work and it takes dedication, and together, through fun and activities, we'll get there. It's very important with the state of the world that we talk about diversity, because in my classroom, I expect diversity from everyone. Everyone has a backstory. Everyone is coming with a story of who they are. And if we as a community can learn from each other's stories, that will unite us together in one race, the human race. So instead of um, supporting diversity or accepting diversity, no, I embrace diversity. I think diversity brings us closer together. We're very much more common than we are apart. So diversity is very important, and, and embracing diversity is my model. But I also feel it's important to believe in yourself. You have to know who you are. Know thyself. So um, I'm going to tell you a little bit about me. I am a teacher from... Beaverton, Oregon, where I was born and raised in Portland, Oregon, and then I matriculated down south to college where I went to Southern Oregon University. I have a degree in directing, I have a degree in teaching, I have a degree in acting, I have a degree in technical theater. So I have lots of degrees and all of them focus on this art and helping you use the art to enrich your life. So believe in yourself because that's really half the battle in life. But we are doing an academic class, and there is going to be acting, so that's fun. Uh, what are the requirements? Do I need a stage? Well, normally, of course, we'd put you up on our stage, but we're not able to meet on our stage. So we have to understand that we're going to be improvising your stage, and together we will be successful. All right. Um, don't stress about you know where to meet or what to meet. As long as you have your Chromebook, with your camera, you're going to be just fine, all right? So I'm sure there's hundreds of questions you have. I want to give you an outlet so that you can just email me right there. And then with that information that you're emailing me, I will order, I will answer them in the order they're received, and as quickly as I humanly possibly can. So go ahead and send me any emails you have. Uh, no question is inappropriate. And you can call me, too. I'll, I'll put my uh, phone number down for people. I don't know if the Nextel works the best. I recommend 
uh, instead of our phone systems that you use the email system. It's more direct and it goes right to my phone. Okay, well without any further ado, again I'd like to say welcome, my, Mr. Foreign, that's me, looks forward to September 14th where I get to see you all. So take care and until then, enjoy the rest of your summer.